Speak down! Remember, Mr. Creed, a mutant saved your life. I just look different! No more mutants! No more mutants! No more mutants. We must use our special gifts to bring peace to mankind. You're a fool, Charles. Look at them. They can't even make peace with each other. I ain't putting up with any trouble from their kind. Skin color prejudice? That's so pathetic, it's almost quaint. It ain't quaint. The fuzzball's a mutant. Get out of my place. We don't want your kind around here. Yeah, why don't you go back to the freak show? I go where I want to go. I thought you all should see this. City officials have begun the quarantine of mutants in an effort to control the mysterious illness which is sweeping the country. Those moss brains can't do that. They got no proof mutants have anything to do with it. What chance does a mutant have tried by normal humans? Are these the people whose laws you trust? They don't seem to share your sense of brotherhood. They only fight because they fear us. Because they don't yet understand. They do understand. Your Honor, because of the severity of this defendant's crime and his demonstrated danger to the community, the people move to deny bail. Your Honor, my client is charged with a simple felony. You're denying him bail just because he's a mutant. We are the friends of humanity. We believe that mutants have their place. It's just not here with us, if you know what I mean. Extermination? Like the rats they are? Well, you'll never hear me say that in public. Better that we die on our feet than live on our knees. Isn't our work more important than catering to those bigots? There's another problem. My daughter means everything to me. I agreed to this experiment, but I will not allow some filthy mutant to touch my daughter. Carly. If it weren't for Dr. McCoy, your daughter's operation would not have been possible. He's a mutant. So often in our history, unhappy, misguided people have created scapegoats, blaming those that are different for the problems in their own lives. tonight is a warning to all mutants of what the future holds for them. Tomorrow belongs to humanity. A humanity cleansed of this foul mutant disease. Here's one of them. A mutant. What should we do with her? Get rid of her. It'll be one less mutant freak. You've heard the verdict. The normal people have spoken. You call this bunch of sickos normal? Why do you hate us? What did we ever do to you? You were born. Take her away. When you and your mutants protect the humans who seek to destroy us. Why? Why have you turned against your own kind? Mutant control law is passed, calling for an army of sentinels. They march over the nation, seeking out mutants, hunting them down like animals. Surrender, mutant. Some fight back. But not for long. The sentinels herd the surviving mutants into detention camps. The camps are your final stop. You never leave. Never! Fool! You still dream of peace with those who would destroy all mutants? Is this your answer? This horror? After all the suffering we both have seen, you wish me to wage war on six billion humans? <laughs> when I was a child, my people talked while others prepared for war. They used reason while others used tanks, and they were destroyed for their trouble. I won't stand by and watch it happen again. I won't! Put me down! Remember, Mr. Creed, a mutant saved your life. 
The Republic of Free Genosha objects strenuously to the use of the term slavery. Mutant powers are a resource to be managed like any other. The mutant race will no longer be managed, Mr. Delegate. Too long have we suffered under the oppression of humankind. I have witnessed firsthand the barbarous treatment of mutants on your wretched little island. We have seen communities torn apart by the jealous hatred of our mutant gifts. Roving mobs of vigilantes seek out the infirm among us. Some mutants conceal their true power, living a charade of normality while their spirit suffocates. There are those who have tried nobly to enlighten their human brethren, to strive for freedom and equality for all men. Their efforts have been repaid with brutality and hatred. Fire on that mutant, full energy! Sometimes I think everybody hates us. For every human who gives in to hate and fear, there are hundreds who are willing to see the truth. They are the future. But the antibodies they created to kill the plague are like none I've ever seen before. Curious, who knows what a study of them could lead to in the future? Dad! Tyler, you're safe. Wolverine's antibodies did preserve the future. I knew it. Join me in my work. That can never be. We each have our own destiny. Only the future will prove which one of us is right. Goodbye.